Yeah, no, I call my specialty uh, sagging, so uh, no, I had on some super fast road tires, the uh, Maxxis Max Lite, so I knew I could roll back there, save a lot of energy, and just uh, pick guys off as their sharpness kind of fell off towards the end, and kind of leapfrogged up on the pavement, that's where I knew I had the speed, and just playing the uh, the last couple laps to try to try to get on the pavement first, and I knew I had the, the speed there for the finish, and it's uh, yeah, pretty special. Finishing under the arch here on the track, a uh, great way to start the Sea Otter weekend for the Scott 3 Rock stream, and uh, yeah, awesome to see the rest of the guys up there the whole day. And exciting race for us. Well, it looked like you had other riders carrying the Scott flag earlier in the day. They were, they were holding it down. I felt like you were the cavalry that showed up really late, and, and they really needed it. Tell me what, when you got up there, was there any team captain, or was it just full gas? Yeah, no, for sure it was awesome. Uh, Derek Cameron flying the flag up there, and definitely the last couple of laps there. Uh, Derek uh, took a flyer and I was able to sit on a little back and just wait for that moment to counterattack uh, with a half lap to go on the backside. I wanted to get in the front so I could lead, lead through the twisty stuff, and, you know, get get on the track, and I felt with uh, the fast max like tires I could take the sprint and it worked out perfectly for us. i got to ask you, tell me a little bit about experience over youth and speed. Simon and Chris, what a talent, what an amazing kid. Yeah, for sure. Those guys were filing bullets at the start, and I was uh, just using my patience and kind of sagging back there, kind of saving saving the watts there for the finish. And uh, no, it's it's great. You know, I've been racing here since '96, and uh, it's always special to come back, and especially when on the track and on the banner. It's, uh, Great for the team. You know, not one Canadian team is going to come play But you always seem to go good. What is it about Canada and Sea Otter and especially just I don't know, it's just, it's, it's special, you know, uh, to have these big races in North America. It's always, you know, stacked up against us when we have to travel to Europe, and it's just great. I mean, I went to the Bay Area, so this is a short drive. And, can uh, take care of ourselves, train, and uh, show up here to these great events that people put on are awesome for us. Congratulations, Jeff.